Hello guys, I am Lisa from GemPages. Welcome to the video tutorial series, GemPages 101. In this video, I will instruct you on putting text over an image. This is one of the most frequently asked questions GemPages got about generic page building tips. This is a popular technique used to create eye-catching banners, collection boxes, that can be linked to product details or lists. So, I will not keep you hanging any longer, let's begin. There are two ways you can add text on top of an image in our editor. The first uses the row element in the left sidebar, and the other uses the hero banner. I will walk you through each right now. Let's start with using row elements first. I choose the two column row element and drag and drop it to the design area. I continue dragging and dropping another row element in the first column. In this row element, I will set up an image as the background. At this point, I can manage how the image is displayed by going to Advanced and choosing Inside Space. The Inside Space refers to the space between the content in the element and its border. I will set up the space from the content to the top and bottom border with 222 pixels. The background image is more aesthetical now. Lastly, I will drag and drop a text element and input text into it. After that, I can customize your text using the new Inline Text Editor, a new upgrade of GemPages 7.0. The other way to put text over images is by using Hero Banner. Hero Banner is an element that allows you to create a large and typically full-width banner image positioned at the top of your website pages. It can help you put text over the image directly without dragging and dropping row elements many times. So I recommend using Hero Banner to save time and reduce manual work dramatically. Using Hero Banner is super easy. From the left sidebar in the editor, I can search for the Hero Banner or scroll down to find the Hero Banner. I will drag and drop the Hero Banner onto the second column. Next, I will configure the image and drag and drop the text element freely. That's it! Now you can easily put text over an image using Row Elements and Hero Banner. This is the end of the video in the GemPages 101 series. I hope you like it. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and turn on all notification bell to learn more fundamental tips and advice to build a store that sells. Thanks for watching.